Hey, hey, I'm Mindy Kinnis. This is The Daily Rage. Just an FYI, this is a week of landmines. <laughs> so please, please be very careful as we proceed into the rest of this week. We made it through Monday and not much was going on today other than Treasury statement late in the day. Tomorrow is PPI, which is a big number, CPI on Wednesday, which is also a big number. And then Thursday, like, the stuff's going to hit the fan because <laughs> we have all at the same time. So 630, this is mountain time zone, jobless, retail, Philadelphia Fed, Empire State, import, export. Then we have 715 industrial production, business inventories, housing market. We don't care as much about natural gas unless you happen to trade it. But those are all like some significant numbers. Then to top it off on Friday, we do have housing starts and permits, but more importantly, consumer sentiment. So please, please be very, very careful. And most especially because the markets are in a really weird place right now. I really don't like trading when it's like this because it's just so volatile. And then as of Friday and today, we got even less range. Like I'm okay with volatility as long as it's like some good range in there because maybe I can sneak in and grab something. But when it's a smaller range than normal, that's even harder. So volatility plus tiny range, not my cup of tea. This is the Dow that we're looking at. It was an inside day from Friday and just at the edge of the cloud right now. The NASDAQ is still, you know, quite a bit below the cloud, but had just a spinning top kind of a day. You guys know how I feel about those. <laughs> Russell looks very similar to the Dow, like just came right back all the way down to the cloud. And then the S&P, another spinning top back into the cloud. So really indecisive, really messy right now. And I will be trading light this week unless something really dramatically changes and we get going in one direction or the other. Whichever one is fine, pick one. Let's go. I'm Mindy Kinnis. Thanks so much for watching.